So another big product from Piranha, as you can see just here, this is your pull and chop. Now you get five super sharp stainless steel blades on different levels. So it cuts in your machine from top to bottom. Just pop it on the spindle, as you can see just there. Also comes with a whisking attachment and a storage. So we'll talk about those in a second. But the worst thing to chop, we all know, is onion. So either half or quarter your onion, just so it fits into your machine, as you can see just there. You can load it right the way up to the top, 900 mil capacity, and pull the pull. Every time you pull that pull, those blades chop two at a time. So the more you pull it, common sense tells you the final chop. So you want to chop onion in second, proceed the stew, curry, a casserole, hamburger, beef burger. It really is that easy. Now we can go from raw onion. What about we do something like raw carrot? You know, if you've got children that don't necessarily eat certain types of vegetables, what you can do with this machine is you can put vegetables in here and then you can hide it. So you can hide things like carrot in a spaghetti bolognese. You could hide maybe pork in mashed potato. Not slip base in the bottom of the machine just here. With this the difficult things that we all struggle to chop. You know, maybe you're a cake baker. You want to do carrot for carrot cake. You see, I don't care how good you are with a knife. Look how super fine that is. Right the way through all of that carrot. So you put that in your spaghetti bolognese, it's perfect. Now, I'm going to show you one more demonstration very quick. You can put in here whatever you want to put in here. So here's something really bad to chop. What about garlic? Because, you know, sometimes it's a little bit too small to hold. You end up trying to cut what you're trying to hold. Now, you can do one clove of garlic in here, or you can fill it right the way up to the top, as you can see. You know, if you do a little bit of uh, maybe thai, Indian, Chinese step in, you want garlic maybe for a certain type of recipe, Again, I don't care how good you are with a knife. Well, look in there. That is chopped to perfection. Now, if you take the blade out of there, if you now fill that with olive oil over the top of your garlic, put your storage lid on there, you can then store that in the fridge or the freezer if you want to use it. You know what, I'll take that here so you can see. It really is that easy and that simple to use. Remember, it comes with a whisking attachment as well. If you put that in, Instead of the blade, you can mix and whisk milk, eggs, cream, sauces. That's your fun chop from Piranha. It really is as easy as that.